Your home for days is tough, but a group of Wisconsin families would do anything just to get back to their own home. The families from the Milwaukee and Madison areas are trapped in Peru. Amy DuPont spoke with the couples who are running out of resources. Amy joins us live now. Well, Stephanie, those families were supposed to fly back to the states on Tuesday, but the Peruvian president put his country on lockdown Monday night and they could not get a flight out. Squeezing together on a hotel bed, these Wisconsin families have never felt more alone. I mean, you're at the mercy of people that really don't care. The seven friends left the U.S. last week headed to a wedding in South America. Well, when we left, there were no travel restrictions, no warnings. Yeah. I mean, South America basically had the least amount of coronavirus cases out there. But Monday, the Peruvian president announced he was putting his country on lockdown, giving visitors just a few hours to leave. The couples headed straight to the airport, along with thousands of others trying to escape. It was a madhouse at the airport. It was just crazy mass hysteria. Every flight booked. When the last plane took off, the airport shut down. So it was just mad chaos. These friends got a hotel room with internet, a lifeline. We have a four-year-old and a 17-month-old at home. To their children and other loved ones back home. We've been able to do FaceTime with the WhatsApp. Um, and we've been able to see them. We know about it. According to the State Department, there are more than 1,000 Americans stranded in Peru. We're looking to get them out with military, probably through the military. But the president did not say when. There's no concrete answers. A handful of other countries have already sent planes to Peru to evacuate their citizens. These Wisconsin friends are praying the U.S. is next. They are healthy, huddled together inside this hotel room, but worry. They're running out of food already. They may run out of hope. Now, Senator Johnson reached out, his office did, to those seven Wisconsin friends this afternoon, just a couple of hours ago. The office says that they are working with the Colombian airline, but right now it is just not clear when or even if those plans are going to make it into Peru to bring those Wisconsin families home. Live in Milwaukee, Amy DuPont, Fox 6 News. We'll keep our viewers updated. Amy, thank you.